This video will introduce you to the courses and lessons available and how to choose one for your class. First, there is one free course consisting of six introductory lessons available for all teachers. You can access courses beyond this by purchasing a classroom, school, or district license. Our course catalog has a complete listing of all premium courses. The course catalog is pretty straightforward. You just need to find your grade level and see the courses recommended for it. There are two courses recommended per grade band. Programming 101, 201, and 301 are for students with no programming experience. The second course for each grade band, 102, 202, and 302, are for experienced students who have previously completed a Tinker course. These intermediate and advanced courses all begin with a review to help students get up to speed. Now here are two classes. One fifth grade class with students who have already taken one Tinker course, and one sixth grade class with students entirely new to programming. I've already assigned Programming 201 to the sixth grade class. Now, I'm going to add 202 to the fifth grade class. Every course is comprised of 16 lessons. Each lesson has an expected duration of one class period. Tinker courses are designed to be completed in one academic term if lessons are done weekly. And if your students complete the materials early, you can always add from our library of over 200 lessons from other courses or our STEM lesson library with lessons in science, math, social studies, and English. And if you click on the lesson in the teacher dashboard, you can see the learning flow for the lesson, answer keys for quizzes and activities, and all the resources to help teach your class. All Tinker courses are grade specific and apply what students are learning in school. For example, mathematical functions are typically covered in eighth grade. So in Programming 301, students learn how to use functions in their programs. Our curricula is aligned with Computer Science Teachers Association standards and Common Core State standards for English Language Arts and Mathematics. You can see the specific standards addressed in each lesson in the Scope and Sequence documents to help you understand the curriculum and find the best match for your needs. This document describes the key skills and concepts, the relevant standards, and a sample application of skills for each lesson. Tinker's curriculum is flexible to fit any class's needs. If you ever need help with choosing the right course, feel free to email us at support at tinker.com.